Isaiah predicted 150 years before the Babylonians were attacked by the Medes that the Babylonians would be defeated by the Medes. But at the time that he predicted, he was laughed at. The Babylonian Empire was large, sophisticated in every kind of weaponry. But the Medes were much smaller and less sophisticated. But 150 years later, the Medes attacked and they prevailed. So I say all that to say that I was on a desperate search for natural answers to all these things. I studied other things, the problem of pain, the resurrection, um, the body of Christ, heaven and hell, and there's so many other things that I looked into, and I came to the point of after about three months of doing all this searching at night, walking around, pacing, looking like some mad professor talking to my siblings, it just can't be true, it just can't be true. But after this three-month period, I made a confession that I never thought I would make. And I didn't know it to be absolutely true, but I said to myself, it's more likely than not I'm a created being. The evidence in an unbiased way when evaluated for what it is in so many different kinds of ways pointed into what I just confessed. A few weeks later, I then solidified that opinion. I said, it's not just more likely. I believe that I am a created being. I believe that the God of the scriptures is that that creator. I began having conversations with him for the first time. I was confessing all the ugly things that I had said in the past, all the things that I had done. I said, please forgive me, and I want to follow you. I don't know exactly what that means. I don't know what that looks like, but I want to follow you. And so from there, a few weeks later, after kind of consolidating all this emotional time frame, this intellectual change, this entire change of the fabric of my life, it's very hard to convey to someone who's not been in that position how ingrained and how fabricated the thinking of naturalism is when that's what you do. That's how you think. That's, that's who you are. With that changed, with that, that undone and making the decisions that I did, I finally told my family and told friends. The common reaction for many of my friends was, anyone but you, Mike. Anyone but you. Anyone but you. 